the presets and how they work in 1.5, um, I'm just going to go to config and reset UI. This is just going to wipe the pages and we get new textures and new pages and everything and now I'm going to do something just so that we can see what's going on which is I'm going to more design I'm gonna to go to design mode and now I'm gonna reset this page and this page to the default template so I'm just gonna double tap on the page control actions reset page to default template we're gonna do it on channel one we're gonna start at five and we're gonna use only unused uh, channel CC's. That will reset that page and now I'm going to do the same thing to this page. I'm going to put it on channel 2, although same difference. So now we've got two pages of controls and now the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to establish uh, a few presets. So uh, the first preset is going to be everything down. So um, that's the first preset so now I'm going to go to more and save it and I'm going to save it in preset one okay so now regardless of what I do uh, to the controls when I go to preset one they snap back and that will send all those values onward as well so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up another preset and this is going to be 20 I also like would like to show you how to access uh, those presets. So I'm going to put all these uh, up to the top here and I'm also going to put this top row on. Okay, And this is going to be preset 20 so I'm going to hit the alt key here and now you see the uh, presets that number up from 11 so I'm going to do save and I'm going to save in preset 20. Okay, so now I've got uh, preset one, which uh, is this one, and I've got preset 20, which is this one. So that's how I switch between them, and each time it's sending out all those values, that's fine. Now what I'm going to do is set that up so it works on a button. So I'm going to go to more, design mode, uh, I'm just going to grab one of these buttons, this one looks good. Okay. And uh, I'm going to take this button and I'm going to change. First of all, I'm going to make it a momentary button. Okay, I can do it as a toggle for global presets and then it would get two different presets. One when it's on and one when it's off. But instead I'm going to do it as a momentary. I go to MIDI and here the global preset is actually one of the message types. So I go into message type and I go into global preset here, apply. And now you can see that the preset off and on values is what's being displayed. Tap on here, uh, MIDI off and on values, and I'm just going to put an on value here. Uh, the MIDI on value is 20, so this will automatically send preset 20. And the off value would be 1. Well, let's see what that looks like first. So now when I hit this, it goes to preset 20, and then it goes to preset 1. Preset 20, preset 1. So that's kind of interesting. If I just wanted it to go to preset 20, go back into design mode, double tap this, go into advanced, send on only. That will make it only go preset 20, and now it's stuck in preset 20. So now I'm going to make another one of these. I'm actually going to take this one and I'm going to go to Actions, Make Similar. And this one uh, is the same. It's also a Send On Only. And this one is going to send 1 when it comes on. So its max value is 1 or its on value is 1. Now I get out of Design Mode and now I've got 1, 20. 1, 20. And that's uh, the way to do it with buttons, and I can also do the same thing with a knob. So, okay, so now I'm going to put in a knob and do the same thing. So add one, put a knob in here. And its message type is going to be global preset. And we can see right now its min is 1 and its max is 20. 
So we're going to get this effect that we expect, which is 1, 20, 1, 20. And of course we've got all the presets in between. And these are global presets, they affect your entire rig, your entire layout. And in the, in the near future we're going to provide presets for just a subgroup or just a group of controls. So thanks for watching and I hope that was helpful and I hope you understand how to assign presets to controls.